Hello Pisces, this is Bonnie with your October, November, December 2017 mini money reading finances. Let's take a shuffle here and see what's coming up for you Pisces. Here we go. Can't believe it's fall already. Let's take a look here. Okay, let's go here. It says that um, I feel like some of you are going to be helped with spirit, actually. I'm not quite sure what that means. It might be that if you're drawn to do something with money or maybe you're drawn to a person or maybe you are going to. OK, I got it. Thank you. It, I, some of you are going to know what to do now. It seems like I think I have this right. It says that the plan that you're making or you're working on right now, it's almost as if you're led. If you're having to make some choices about money or you have fear about money, you're going to know what to do here very shortly and your fears are going to be put to rest says if you look back how things were in the past there could be some changes there a lot of you have learned how to deal with um, finances or create with finances or make finances grow and this is pretty awesome it says um, sometimes even things that work before they might need to be tweaked or a little change here and it says things could certainly improve for you some of you are thinking about changing jobs or you're having an opportunity maybe something's being presented to you and you're going to have a choice to make whether you go or stay or maybe it's even a promotion within the company you're in and wondering what you should do it says step back take a deep breath it says you can't choose wrong uh, the only choice you would, could make is bypass and not make a choice. If you choose to stay where you're at, things are going to be fine. If you're willing, if you're kind of wanting to do something else, this might be the perfect opportunity for you. Only you can decide that. And it says you won't choose wrong. It says you'll be guided if you just kind of take your time and, and wait to see what's going on a little bit. It says um, something of money is going to be offered to some of you. If you're selling a home or you're wanting to buy a home, the money could certainly be there for that. If you're uh, wanting to start a business, um, it just says that there's going to be money available for you for something you're wanting to do, some of you. So enjoy, you know, make sure you have a plan. Again, I can't, I sound like a broken record today, but I know planning is very important when it comes to your finances. And it says, don't have any guilt about how things were before. Sometimes things are out of our control. It says, you've worked very hard and you've learned a lot of things to do. So it might even be it's time for you to have what you want. So it's just don't make any foolish choices. Don't, you know, quit your job and, and move away not having one. It says if you have, if you want to leave your job, have a job lined up before you go and things will be much easier for you. It says a lot of you have had improvement, those of you that are in relationships, because the money has been um, discussed. The finances have been discussed and it seems like you're both working together and this is such a good thing. Very, very good thing for you. It says there could still be a little gaiety in the midst of change. Things changing means new items, new uh, ways of doing things. It might even be, especially with a new job, it might be a little fearful of, oh my gosh, I'm going to be working somewhere else. Well, it says Things do go up and down, up and down, but it says for finances, it looks like it's going to be pretty good for you, Pisces. It says that you have truly learned from how things were handled in the past, and it says there's been a change and an improvement for a lot of you, but it's because of what you've learned, and nobody can take that from you unless you give it away or make and don't continue on the way that you're going. It says there's things already in the works for some of you. It says if you, those of you that are getting in a relationship or getting ready to marry or make a permanent commitment, maybe finances should be discussed. It says they're important to you and for your mate or partner. They need to be, uh, you both have to be on the same page with that. It says there's going to be reasons to celebrate because of that. I'm not sure exactly why, but it's a good thing. And then it says new beginnings. It could be new job, new relationship, something like that. I have the Ace of Wands. And it says some of you may be leaving things behind, okay? Maybe you're going to leave the way of doing things uh, in the past behind and make new choices for your future. It says the choices you make are going to be really good and be very good for you. I have the Ace of Swords, which makes me feel that there will be victory in what you choose here for yourself. Chariot, one who achieves greatness. It says the plans that you put into practice over this next three months. There might be a little glitch, but don't get upset. Find the way. Find the niche because it says that what you work on is going to um, give you alms dispensed with justice, which means money coming or a nice flow of money. And it says victory certainly could be yours. It says many will have like an aha moment and they'll learn from past mistakes. Okay, we can't dwell on the mistake but if we can look at a mistake from the past maybe there was a bankruptcy maybe your 
business close. Maybe you lost your job. But what I'm saying is, if you can learn from that and move forward, your intuition is going to have a lot to do with it. I feel there's going to be victories for many, many of you. And um, <clears throat> it says almost like an apprenticeship, you're going to learn how to do things that work for you. And if you're in a partnership for you and your home or, or you and who you're with. But it says if not, you need counsel from outside, get it. Maybe um, you, the two of you can't agree on exactly how to do it and you might need some counsel. And that's good. It could be a financial planner. It could be a lawyer. It could be just a friend who is an accountant. But the information that you get together is going to be very good for you. It says excuses are gone. Now those of you that keep saying I'll start tomorrow, I'll start tomorrow. I kind of think tomorrow is here today. And it says, you shouldn't be having arguments about money. It should be discussions if you need to. And it says, it could start slowly, but what you put into practice is going to pay off for you. I feel changes are coming for a lot of you. And I have the Nine of Cups, which means you get a wish and things kind of seem to fall into place. So if you do make some kind of choices here, stick to them and it looks like it could turn out really well for you. I so appreciate you dropping in. This is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. I will be doing that uh, Healing Gem video, which is going to be separate, but I just thought I'd let you know it'll be coming out shortly after this. So thank you. We'll see you next month.